Take two. Action. Good morning, dolphins. I'm Ethel from Miss Fuchs class. I'm Lucy from Miss Fuchs class. And, and this, this is the WNTE News. News. Today's date is Tuesday, March 29th. Today is National Mom and Pop Business Owners Day. What is a mom and pop business? A mom and pop business is a small business owned by people who live in the area. For instance, Madam Moore Coffee in Hampstead is owned by family right here in town. Some people like to support local businesses like Madam Moore instead of corporations. Shout out to the local business owners of Hampstead. <laughs> now it's time to take it over to Brooke for the weather report and some Tuesday trivia. Good morning, Dolphins. I'm Brooke, and this is your weather report. There will be a mix of clouds and sunshine in the morning, followed by more clouds in the afternoon. Today, the high is only 57, and the low is 50 degrees. Winds are coming from the northeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. There is no chance of rain today. Now get this. The high tomorrow is 76, North Carolina. How are we supposed to know how to dress this month? Hopefully you just warm today, but tomorrow is more like spring weather. Dolphin, I have a little spring trivia for you. Will your class get the right answer before the end of the episode? Let's see. There are four seasons. Spring is one of them. What are the other three seasons? I'll be back with the answer at the end of the episode. Good luck. Back to you, anchors. Thank you, Brooke. I know the answer, but I won't tell. Happy birthday to Jack Bonnet and Miss Wolf class. Happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by the school pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge to be safe, well prepared, in control, and to make the right choices. You may be seated. In school news, Dolphins, I'm so proud of everyone for passing our first goal to help the Leukemia and Lymph Node Society. We rock. Here's an update from the Hero Squad. It's the final countdown, North Topsoil. Our character trait of today is courage. That means the ability to do something that frightens you. And with that in mind, we want to introduce you to Nicholas. Nicholas is 14 years old. He had baby battle leukemia for the past four years. When he found out he had cancer, he was very scared. Throughout his journey, he met so many amazing cancer warriors. The Leukemia and Lymphoma Society has helped his family just like so many others. He is so grateful to use his voice to raise awareness about kids with blood cancer. Nicholas is stronger because of his hard time. He is very courageous. He faces his fears and overcomes them. Nicholas is our hero of the day and... Every hero needs a squad! That's right. Our fundraising count for today is $1,810 dolphins. Yay! Great job! Wow! Now our quest is to raise the last $190 in the next few days. The hero squad has a new plan. We would like to invite classes to our Landform Museum this Friday, April the 1st. We will provide tickets for our event and welcome all staff and students to come by and check out our Landform slideshows and artwork. There is no charge for this, just an opportunity to bring a little donation with you if you feel led to. So please stop by on your way to Encore classes, recess, or on your way back from lunch. We won't keep you long and we promise that you will leave smarter and with a warm feeling in your heart. Thank you so much for your support and have a great day, Dolphins. Thank you, Ms. Martin, for bringing us this opportunity to help others in need. Your students are doing an awesome job reading. Way to go, first graders. Thank you also to anyone who has contributed their spare change to the cause. 
What a kind and generous thing to do. It is extra inspiring to see the generosity of the Hero Squad at North Topsail because this isn't the kind of fundraiser that involves a prize. You are all donating out of the goodness of your heart. We are helping people. Way to go, Dolphins! Now here's Brooke with the trivia answer. I'm back. Did you remember the other three seasons besides spring? And the answer is... Fall, winter, and summer. We also call fall autumn. Good job if you knew these. Also, happy belated birthday yesterday to Piper Santiago and Mrs. Pridgen's class. Sorry we missed it. I hope your birthday rocked. Back to you, anchors. Teachers and students, nice job if you got the answer correct. That's the wrap. Have a terrific Tuesday. The fundraiser ends Friday. Keep that change coming. I'm Lucy. And I'm Ethel. Don't forget to swim to a success. And keep swimming. Next keep swimming. Bye, Dolphins.